Welcome back to Infigan friends. In this video, we are going to take up one very interesting and challenging question from system of equations with log function. We have got two equations. The first equation is x square plus xy plus y square is equal to 9. And second equation is log root 3 with base xth root 3 plus log 2 with base yth root 4 equal to root 3. And we have to find out real solutions. So let's get started with equation 2 and I will begin with logarithmic properties. So let me write our first log property which is log a base b can be written as log a base 10 change of base over log b base 10. Let us apply here. So I will write log root 3 root 3 I will write 3 power half with base 10 divided by log base is 10 now and this I will write 3 power 1 over x first term is done plus similar job we will do for second term so log 2 I will write with base is 10 divided by log of 4 raised to the power 1 over y and equal to right hand side unchanged root 3. Now I will use our second property of log which is log a power b can be written as this exponent will become multiplier b log a. So let us apply. See this term, this numerator, this exponent basically I will consider as a multiplier. This will come as a multiplier. This will come as a multiplier. So let us write. I will consider half times log 3 base is 10 divided by 1 by x times log 3. These two log 3 you will cancel plus log 2 in denominator you will take this 1 over y out and log 4 equal to root 3. Now I will write our log 4. See how it will be. Log 4 you will write log 2 square and then using this property you will take this power as a multiplier. So 2 log 2. Log 4 is 2 log 2. So here I will write 2 log 2. Let me write half over 1 by x plus log 2 divided by this y will reach to the numerator and log 4 you will write 2 log 2. Now you can see log 2 log 2 will be over. So ultimately one equation and see this will be reflected. So I will write x over 2 plus y over 2 equal to root 3. Now let me frame log free system of equation. I will write first equation as it is x square plus xy plus y square equal to 9 and second equation which we calculated that is x over 2 plus y over 2 equal to root 3. Now you can see we will multiply second equation with 2 so that denominator will be over. So I will multiply this equation with 2. So I need to multiply here with 2 also. Then equation will become x plus y equal to 2 root 3. Done. Now I will consider squaring both sides. Let's consider squaring. See you can consider this is equation 1 and this is equation 2. Once you will take whole square both sides, it will become x square plus y square plus 2xy equal to 2 square is 4, root 3 square is 3, 4 times 3, 12. Now I will take away first equation from second so that I will collect my xy. So now let me call this is equation 3 better is to say. So I am doing 3 minus 1. Once I will consider 3 minus 1, 
it will give us only xy in the LHS. And right hand side 12 minus 9, so 3. Now ultimate set of equation is x plus y is 2 root 3 and xy is 3. We have to solve only this system of equation. So I will consider y value from e this second equation y will be 3 over x and this value I will put over first one. So I am going to consider x plus 3 over x equal to 2 root 3. x plus 3 over x equal to 2 root 3. Multiply this equation with x. So x square plus 3 equal to 2 root 3 x. Take all the term to one side. x square minus 2 root 3 x plus 3 equal to 0. Let us apply Sridharachar formula. So I will write x is equal to minus b. So 2 root 3 only plus minus under the root b square. So minus 2 root 3 whole square. Again you will write 12 minus 4ac. a is 1, c is 3, 4 times 1 times 3, 12 divided by 2a so 2. You can see square root will be over. So it is left with 2 root 3 over 2. Now 2 2 you will cancel. So ultimately what we are getting that is root 3. Square root 3. Now xy was 3. If you will check the equation second in system of equation second equation xy is equal to 3. So, once we know x is equal to root 3, we will write y is equal to 3 over x. Now, if x is root 3, then I will write root 3. So, y is coming out root 3 only. 3 you will write root 3 times root 3. 1 root 3 will be over. So, ultimate solution is root 3 and root 3. Let us verify. I will consider verification. Let me write here. I will consider our first equation right now on screen. This equation which we converted x over 2 plus y over 2 equal to root 3. Okay. Now let us put x is equal to root 3 and y is equal to root 3. Let me write here. So root 3 over 2 plus root 3 over 2 which will be equal to root 3 equal to RHS, hence verified. First equation is correct. Now come to the second one. x square equation number 2. x square plus xy plus y square. So I will write root 3 square plus root 3 times root 3 plus root 3 square. Root 3 square is 3 root 3 times root 3 is the same thing, root 3 square, 3, root 3 square, 3, 3 plus 3 plus 3 equal to 9 and which is your RHS, hence verified. I hope this video will be meaningful to you. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe friends. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care.